and you may proceed. Thank you. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kelsey McAllister of Marin County, California. The California Family Law Courts are endangering the lives of children, families, and communities. A handful of predatory lawyers, judges, and auxiliary service providers have hijacked our court system and have run rogue. They are maximizing the financial gains by fleecing families of all of their resources and creating protracted litigation to exploit the amount of federal and state funding funneling through their courts and into their pockets. The result has been a dramatic increase in child custody related homicides. In the state of California alone, a new news story of a family law related homicide shows up online every six weeks. A dramatic increase in the, amount, the number of years that families are kept in litigation, the average now being 10 years. A dramatic increase in the cost of divorce and child custody arrangements for families. Families are being left homeless, penniless, possessionless, and at least one parent so marginalized that they become childless. The most dramatic examples of, the, of this are cases that involve domestic violence and child abuse. <laughs> While 70% of divorce cases settle outside of the court, nearly all contested cases in the family law court system involve child abuse and domestic violence. Judges deny and ignore evidence produced by police departments, CPS, medical professionals, therapeutic professionals, educational professionals, and then deliver children into what all five of these entities are finding to be unsafe environments with absolutely no oversight. The outcomes for these cases are consistent throughout the state of California. No matter what type of the abuse, no matter how irrefutable the evidence, no matter what court, what county in the state of California, when a child reports abuse, when a parent reports abuse, family law courts then give the identified abuser full or partial custody of these children. The child is removed from everyone who identified the abuse. The parents, grandparents, extended family members, siblings, doctors, therapists, teachers, anyone who stands up for that child to protect that child from abuse is removed from the child's life immediately. The abuser is given full reign to sequester that child from any avenue of help, and the results have been that these children are dying in the custody of these abusers. We are making the California judicial seconds. We are making the California Judicial Council members aware of the corruption that is currently taking place. History will remember this committee as either those who gave a voice to Californians or those who helped cover up the uh, court's abuses of ch California's children and families. The public deserves a public hearing on these matters immediately. Thank, Thank you. you.